wiring in the backup camera. Shucks. Shucks fuzzy. Hashtag builds on a budget. <laughs> I broke it. We are Matt and Cass, and in 2020, we bought a city shuttle bus and converted her into our tiny home on wheels. Once completed, we sold our house and have been living and traveling the U.S. the past two years. We decided to downsize again and bought a 1988 Astro Tiger Pro Band to convert into our new, more capable, tiny home. Follow along as we bring this old beauty back to life. Good morning, guys. This is such a big milestone and a very, very exciting video. This is our first episode of our van conversion. So Matt is already outside working on the van. Let's go see what he's up to. Good morning, love. Morning. What's the project for today? Uh, we're wiring in the backup camera. Uh, the reason this is the first project is this is our everyday driver while we're doing the conversion and we have the bus. Uh, so having the backup camera is going to be useful. The project's interesting because we don't have any front cigarette outlets in the Astro right now. So I'm taking this cigarette outlet extension and USB extension that we used in the bus. And I'm actually hardwiring it into the van to then use the power supply for the... Um, backup camera to go in here and then we also have an additional cigarette outlet and two usbs uh so yeah kind of fun job it was interesting when i cut the end of this to find that the ground wire isn't cased at all so i'm separating the two and i'll just do some electrical tape make it two wires plug one in the fuse panel ground it and we should be good to go Okay guys, just a little tour about where we're parked up for a week and a half. We are in Cedar City, Utah um, on some public land and it is so beautiful. Like let's look around. We got this like canyon here, some beautiful mountains over there and it's just like wide open so it's the perfect place to start converting. Oh, girl, better get this motherfucker right. I only got one. Only got one? Only got one. <laughs> one of the right size little <laughs> it's like two dogs. That's it. One chance of one. Only got. Wait, how's that Eminem song go? Only got one chance. No, that's not right. De definitely not how that Eminem song goes. You look good under there. Doesn't feel good. No. Hurts my neck hurts <laughs> my back. My P and my. Oh God. Oh no! Is that appropriate? I broke it. You know, my one chance. The one piece we had. I went Hulk on it. Just don't know my own strength. So, I think I'm gonna have to stop here until I get... <laughs> no! So is this the end of this project already? Progress, huh? <laughs> this is so van life, bus life, conversion realities. Yep. One piece that I don't have. I got plenty of these guys. And those guys just won't work? No, ma'am. Uh, shucks. Shucks fuzzy. Natali, you're supposed to be working. <laughs> supposed to be helping dad, and this is what we get. That's it? You're right. Working on sleeping, Ma. Working on sleeping. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna wire it a little ghetto. It's alright. So, looks like we're going to Home Depot. <laughs> we that that dude I piece. said that we didn't have came back to bite us yeah. that is that is the one that we need um basically i wasn't able to get into the little terminal on the fuse the way i needed to and that was the problem all along there wasn't actually any problem with how anything was wired i just wasn't able to get into the little terminal i needed to so so next time you try to jerry-rig something I mean, maybe just go by the right everything part. <laughs> else is jerry rigged correctly. Yes. It's just the connector that I needed. Not even the correct piece. Like, it could have been the wrong <laughs> piece. It just, <sighs> I just fit into where I needed it to fit into. 
this whole series is going to look a lot like this probably. Yeah. It does. It's the reality. So to Home Depot we go. Something we want to talk about a little bit is like the budget this time around. Um, since we haven't sold the bus and we're living out of the bus, everything, every penny that we put into this rig is coming out of our pockets, which is obviously harder than selling the vehicle and then having all that money to convert with. We don't have it because we are living in the rig and traveling in it. So it'll definitely be hashtag build on a budget. <laughs> so you guys get to see all the behind the scenes of what that looks like. All right, so we're back. We got the right piece. The little wire um, connector that is flat, so it will actually slide into the fuse box um, of the van. So we got this done. That red wire right here is what I wired into the fuse box. Then we have it grounded. And basically it was to hardwire in this cigarette outlet. And now I'm just going to get this cigarette outlet glued up there or use a command strip or something that I can then plug our backup camera into. So we are there, ladies and gentlemen. I already made sure we have the power live. So I am going to go on the back, uh, do our first holes into the outside of the van, which is a little frightening, a little exciting all at the same time. Let's go back there and put on the backup camera. There we go. First hole. Oh god, how deep is that gonna go? You were very confident. Yeah. Not your first hole you drilled in the rig. <laughs> All right, so the camera is hooked up to a fuse that turns on when the ignition is on. Woo! Yeah. yeah! That's a working backup camera. Money! Get back there, get back there. All right. So that's a video, that's the first one, not that exciting of a project, just a backup camera, but we got more content coming for you. Yes, so we make do. sure you like this video, subscribe to this channel to check out the other projects that we're gonna be doing. We'll Love be doing electrical, we'll be doing a Max fan install, we're gonna be doing all sorts of stuff. Cheers, y'all. Cheers! <laughs>